The Oakland A's have announced layoffs ahead of their move to West Sacramento to play at Sutter Health Park for the 2025 season through 2028. The A's said they weren't announcing the number of layoffs, but a source inside the organization tells us 50% of the non-baseball staff is being laid off. The A's saying the layoffs will be after the season, which would mean they would be in October. Now, this is just the latest blow to the 123-year-old Oakland A's organization with such a loyal fan base. And we spoke to former A's pitcher Trevor May after the announcement was made in April that the team was moving and layoffs were feared. This is what he had to say about his interactions with staff. A lot of people that worked at the Coliseum and stuff are also not going to have their jobs anymore. And uh, people who've been there for decades, uh, like half the people there have worked there for decades. It's a very close knit loyal place. So um, it's it's sad that they they have to now change what they're doing too. And and hopefully um, they're able to land on their feet because they had something consistent that's not going to be consistent anymore. So that's kind of where I'm coming at, uh, coming from. And people I care about are, are being adversely affected in that way. And that that's not that's not the best feeling. The A's organization provided the following statement. We have had to make the difficult decision to restructure our workforce due to our relocation to Sacramento next year. This was not an easy decision. We want to acknowledge the significant contributions of each employee affected by our staffing adjustments. Their dedication and hard work have been invaluable to our organization, and we are grateful for all they have done. When the A's first made this announcement back in April, ABC 10 had an exclusive interview with President Dave Cavill, and we asked him about layoffs. Here's what he had to say. Obviously, there is going to be a reduction in force as part of this. You know, the extent of that is not determined yet. We are partnered with the River Cats and, and the Kings on some of the aspects of putting the games on here. And we're going to work closely with our staff, and many of those staff have been here a long time, to ensure either they have a spot in the, here in Sacramento or maybe in Las Vegas, because we'll be opening an office there soon, um, or there's an appropriate severance package the same thing that the Raiders and some of the other teams that have departed have done. So I think there's some lessons in that to learn. Um, but that is a, a unfortunate part of the situation and one that we take very seriously and we want to treat people appropriately and in the right way. The A's said they're providing severance but gave no specifics. A source from inside the organization told us workers will be given one month severance for every year worked.